the challenger, Julio Cesar. trying to do Chavez, he's trying to slow down the movement of Rosario. Neither of them takes a backward step. Rosario, he's like a little magician there. I just don't like him there in the corner or against the ropes, rather. A couple of left hands by Rosario. Both guys have very, very good defense. Chavez is just keeping his man there in the corner. He's making the fight his fight. We'll hold it. We'll hold it. Watch for the uppercuts inside by Chavez. Those are kind of punches that do the most damage. Chavez came over the top that time with a right hand. It was a good shot. We'll hold, we'll hold. And still Rosario has his back to the ropes and he has most of the first round. You notice little short shots. As advertised. Body shots. Of personal experience, I know that uh, the more effective Sario with his back to the ropes. Uppercut by Chavez. Watch the body shot, because the uppercut raised the chance, and the right hand will do the damage. There's the uppercut, and left hook will do fine too, Barry. Good body shot, good body Keep shot by Chavez. Now those are the type of shots that take your legs away from you. You won't see as much movement from Rosario if, if uh, you just take those kind of punches. That was a combination by Rosario, and Chavez comes right back at him. And again, the uppercut, that was right on the button. You see, now he's, Chavez is using both hands now. Rosario, that is. Let's see what Chapo Rosario's tactics are this time. He starts out in the center of the ring. Took a right hand, and it backed him up. Chavez has the experience. 54 fights. He averages almost seven fights a year. That was a right hand by Rosario. Not like that in Rosario. He goes to the body, but he, he doubles up with the same hand. But I just don't like when he stands directly in front of his man. Another good right hand by Rosario. Chavez, for some reason, is waiting. There was a big left hand by Chavez. Trying to spend a lot of energy. Good right hand. Broad shoulders. Right hand, a little overhead right. of a fight that could come down to condition. Yeah, that was a hit fight hit also. Hit. Now we're seeing jabs, left jabs from Chavez. Good head movement by Chavez, very good head movement. You know what he walks, keeps his eyes on his opponent. He's blocking a lot of those shots with his arms. He's good, good, very good concentration. There it, that's it. Right off the ropes with a good shot. Watch, now he can start to double up to the body, watch. You see here, this is when he gets his man in trouble. This is when Rosario gets days to get out of there. Chavez pressing Rosario. You see what happens, Barry? He turns the table around because he lets his man throw his punches and then he comes on. He retaliates. He doesn't let up at this point. That's why I, I admire mostly about Chavez. Now for Rosario, he has to forget about the machoism and then box again. Get his man to clear his head. Good shot. Double shot. Double left hooks. 
What's come back up to the head? The left hook there is a beautiful short. There was a right hand by Rosario, but Chavez remains right on top of it. Rosario is here, still is clear. He's watching his man. But Chavez is coming out on top here. Hunting it out. Good round. Good round for Chavez. Plus, I think uh, a fighter like Chavez is a natural. He's a thinker. And yet Rosario hasn't taken a step back. Big right hand by Chavez. Now what Chavez is doing is actually the same principle of chopping the tree down. Three punch combination, one of them is low, but... And another right hand by Chavez. Combination again. This is another dominant round for Chavez so far. There is no, I don't see the snap I see with uh, Rosario. Once again, as Larry Merchant pointed out a little bit earlier, he's just not giving Rosario room to punch. what's not making this any better for Rosario is the fact that Chavez has been perpetual motion. Don't have it on a particular night. It's the most frightening experience you can have. And here, that was a good combination. This is dangerous for, for both fighters here because they both will the way. Chavez again. He has, Chavez has really turned this into a street fight. A beautiful street fight, that is. Look at the way he doubles up the hook, triples up his hook. Always finishes to the body. And of course, one of the judging criteria is ring generalship. And Chavez just seems to have all of that. Look at the, look at the combinations. And that hurt Rosario. The ring, slipping punches. I think that Chavez is taking a blow. I think so. He, he executed or exerted himself a great deal in that sixth round. Threw a lot of punches. And now he's back on the attack, throwing a lot of punches again. And uh, what normally a, a smart fighter would do, he would move around and use the ring. And they come back. Again, this is not a good place for Rosario to be. Especially when he's standing straight up. You see what happens? Look how he worked the body. Both hands, both sides, both sides, digging both sides. That's what my trainer Dave Jacobs taught us years ago. Work both sides. More than not quit here, he's got to start hurting the other guy. And he took a good shot from Chavez. Body shots, right hand. The jab's gonna lead him inside. Mouthpiece flew out of the mouth of Rosario. Just so smart. And there's a big combination. That hurt Rosario. It also cut him. And he's in a world of trouble. Oh, no. This is experience here. Still 30 seconds remaining in round number eight. And Rosario will do well just to get through the round. Took another good right hand. Still 15 seconds. Look at the combinations, Barry. And now I see angles by Rosario, but it may be a little too late for that now. Because he was really rocked. And Rosario's gonna get through this round. Well, what a, <laughs> he's down about G right now, I think. Well, both the fans was hurt. There. Both fighters blocked each other. Coming from the mouth of Chapo Rosario. Oh, that was that punch hurt. That punch really hurt Rosario. He caught Chavez caught him moving in.
because he's giving away two in the round. Oh, Chavez is taking some in the round. Another right hand here and said, I like it if Rosario doesn't step back. That was a good left hand. It just stopped Chapo in his tracks. Oh, this, he's hurt very bad. Rosario's ready to go. And then come back with something. Left hook there. Rosario just looks like a beaten man. He has absorbed an awful lot and is in trouble again. Chavez has to keep doubling those punches up, ways doubling those combinations up. Both hands, both hands. And the left hook. Inside of 30 seconds remaining. Trying to hang in there. I'll be interested to see what is going to, what is going to stop the fight. Because he's really hurt. But he's holding his own, huh? But taking a brutal beating here. Corner may stop the fight. Harold, how do you have it now? Larry, very, very big for Julio Chavez. I just think Edwin Rosario is getting mugged. Look at me, Chapo. Look at me. Up. Look at me. Up and up. And the doctor is now looking He's okay. He's okay. at Rosario's He's okay. eye. There's a big, big swelling under Rosario's left eye. The eye of Rosario is now virtually closed. Richard Steele almost certainly will not let this go too far. Rosario just fighting on guts. Because like now, Rosario can't see the right hand coming. What he's doing now, he's actually just winging his own punches and hope one land. He's fighting on sheer determination. Look at the body shots. You gotta appreciate them. Both Chavez hands. not letting him out of the corner, continuing to just put all the pressure on Edwin Chapo Rosario. Butting to both men. What I see now is a right hand, probably in the punch. <laughs> Rosario giving one for every three he gets. Well, the mouth, I just noticed the mouthpiece is in Rosario's mouth. <laughs> Rosario just does not seem to be able to get himself out of his own corner. Punching it out! the mouthpiece What's that? one minute remaining in the 11th round Come on. well if Hart wins fights then Rosario they might get a draw they that's it, they threw the towel in it's over Rosario never quit, but his corner did the right thing. Corner, like Larry said, did the right thing. Let's take a look at the last minute or so of this fight, and you can see that face tells you the story of this fight. Rosario threw 731 punches. You believe that in 11 rounds? That's almost 70 punches around. Landed only 264. Chavez was just brilliant in his execution, 61%.